Hey guys, welcome to another edition of the Booster Demon. Today we have a box of collector's boosters from Throne of Eldraine. That's right, I threw down 330 bucks, and let's see if we get it back at all. <laughs> uh, it's kind of a crapshoot, so let's, let's open this guy up and find out what is going on. Okay, we did it. The seal's broken. Here we are. All right. Reminds me of a case of fancy cigarettes. There we go. Six. And, and six more. So we got our full allotment. All right. Pack number one. Oh boy. See what happens here. All right. First card is a idyllic range, silver flame ritual. All right. Well, we got a regular Merfolk Secret Keeper. These are the foils. I'm not gonna really, unless there's a really cool foil, I'm not gonna, you know. Oh, there we go. So our first set of um, we got our showcase cards. So we got a common. That's good. Here we kind of want the commons because you can't really get them in the booster packs. Got a Queen of Vice and a Reaper of Night. Okay. Fairy Formation. I th uh, I'm not really sure where this is from. I think this is from um, Brawl, maybe? Got a Witch's Vengeance. That's our extended art. Oh, and we got a Fabro Elder in extended. Wow, that's pretty good. It's kind of like a... What's up? That one... I can't really think of this name anymore. That druid. All right. Well, that's our our first pack. So we got a uh, witch's vengeance and a Faber elder. I'm going to just split these up a little bit. That way we can kind of showcase things. So here's our non foil extended art, foil extended art, and then our ancillary stuff here. Okay. Cool. All right. That was pack one. Pack two. A bar which is Knight of the Keep. Oh, we got a full Reaper of Night. Okay, let's put that. The other showcase cards. Dwarven Mine. Okay, anything. Bell of the Brawl. Okay, we got another showcase. Well, it's not a showcase, it's just an adventure fairy. Alright, on to our um, sh showcase cards. We got an uncommon. And then we have common curious pair. And remember, we're looking for the commons because those are the money cards here, actually, ironically. Tactician and. <laughs> what is. Okay. Well, that's terrible. We got a Windscarred Craig. I don't know if these things are probably not worth anything, but that's our ancillary card. Ancillary card, sorry. So that was, a, that was bad. That was real bad. Were the knights are um, full art, non foil? And we got. Oh, we got a castle. Uh, Garenbrig as our full art. So we got two full art um, or extended art foils, not full art, and a human token. Cool. All right, that was pack two. So pack three. Oh, it feels like I've already done an entire video. It was weird. Oh, we got a Garenbrig carver. Let's go here. Oh, uh, we got a thunder snapper. Yeah, well, I mean, only I would be excited because it's a turtle hydra, so yeah, that's, that's really cool. Okay, here we go. We got an uncommon fairy showcase. Oops. And another uncommon, so we don't really want these because we can get these in the regular booster packs. And we got a spin sword, uh, sword master common. That's good. Our ancillary card looks like it's a rare. It's a thorn mammoth. No idea what that is. I think that's probably in a brawl deck. We got a castle. And it's our, oh, looks like it's just a regular foil. Oh no, it's a Pyromancer extended art foil. I want a full fairy. Cool. I believe these are like double sided too. So, well, so far no. Yeah, so far everything's been extended art, so that's good, I guess. All right, pack three. That's pack three already. So one, two, three, four, five, six, two. Oh yeah, four. This is pack four. Oops, sorry. Ooh, we got a Queen of Ice in foil. That's good. Oh, 
not really sure what the I guess with the ancillary cards I'm not really sure where to put them, but I'll just put them right here. Queen of Ice, red cap, red cap melee, okay. We got a legend, that's good. Okay, here we go. Showcase cards. We got the carver, that's good. It's a common. Fairy Guide Mother, that's a nice, really nice, nice looking card. Common. Oh, and a Merfolk Secret Keeper in common, that's good. Elko's a conical. So this is a common. Wow. Now we're we're really not hitting very good on, <laughs> on these ancillary cards here. Doom foretold, okay. Oh, and a full fate of wishes. So now we've hit our first wah wah. No extended art. Just the regular fate of wishes in foil. Which is I guess whatever. Oh, and a dwarf token. I guess it's whatever. I'm putting my whatever's right over here. That's where all that stuff will go, yeah, because these are all showcase. These will just be the extended arts, and those are the ex uh, foils, and then those are the extended All right, cool. So I'll just move this over to the side here. Sorry about that. So you can get it in frame. All right, this is pack five out of 12. Okay, okay. Cool, we got an Archon. That's good. Oh, we got Shepherd of the Flock. Oh, wow. We got... Wow, that's weird. I thought this was the showcase slot. We got a full art Oko. Or a borderless Oko. Weird. Okay. Well, I'm going to take that. I like that. That's really good. Here we go. Lonesome Unicorn. Rock Knight. So this is also a foil. Or not. I mean, it's a rare. It's Silver Wing Squad. Huh, we got a return of the loudspeaker. Okay, and a bone crusher giant. Okay. Okay, so weird. Okay. That's cool. I guess I didn't realize you could get the extended arts in um, the showcase uh, slot. Wow, nice. Too bad it wasn't a, a foil version. <laughs> All right, I don't, don't want to get too greedy here. Right. I should have been checking prices earlier, but that's all right. I'm not going to. Waste time checking prices. Let's see. Okay, so what's that? Oh, it's the Fairy Vandal. That's that's a cool card, actually. Oh, okay, so we got a full Beanstalk Giant. Okay, so now here we are. Our common showcase is Merchant, the Queen, and a Tree Folk, which is good. Okay, so we got a Brawl, Commander, a Layla, and she's non foil. So that's cool. Not really sure where to put these guys. Uh, Oh, probably have to start a separate we'll get guy from uh, fires of invention and we got <laughs> feasting troll king all right well yeah all right so that was kind of a bummer all right so what I'm gonna do I'm probably just gonna have wins card Craig oh my god so I'm gonna put all our ancillary cards here I guess the Craig is technically an an ancillary card. And then I guess we'll put uh, we'll put our foils as well. So our showcase cards will go here. Our just regular foil rares, our ancillary cards. There's a lot of different skews in these things here. It's weird. Uh, okay, <laughs> I got a common for an ancillary card. Kind of disappointing. I mean, even if I get like a weird rare that I don't know about, I'm still okay with that. All right, there we go. So, and then these are our common foils and stuff like that. Cool. All right, so that was half of the box. That was that our first half. So, so far we got three full arts, full art foils of varying values. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We got seven full art um, non-foils. All right, pack seven. Ooh, we got a foil golden egg. That's nice. Oh, that's nice. Fairy Guide Mother. That looks awesome. I was hoping to get one of these in foil. Princess. Okay. Tomb Raider. Sprites. That's a lot of fairies in foil. That's good. Shine Chaser is a fairy. Okay. So Shepherd of the Flock. Well, that's an uncommon. Common. Common. Okay, another common ancillary card, which is Garrison Griffin. Oh, we got a full art once upon a time. That's good. And we got a, okay, we got a return of the wild speaker. <laughs> well, not that great. 
Okay, cool. So it looks like what we're looking for are those full art, ex the extended art ones. And... Alright, am I gonna make my money back? I don't know. Reaper of the Night. Store of Mind, Witching Well. They have a Ranger, that's really cool. And foil. Seller Elmer. Okay, Love Struck Beast. So we got a showcase rare. Uncommon. Uh, common. Chittering Witch. Must be a brawl card. Oh wow, you know what? That's a not I don't think it's a great card, but it's a cool looking picture. Extended. I didn't realize it was that blue, I just thought it was like an all black card, but Clackbridge Troll. And we got a full witch's wind, it's alright. So Wow. We we're doing really good. We ripped like three extended arts foils right away, and then now it's just like now it's just nothing. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Oh, wow. We start off with a curious pair. That's a beautiful card. These showcase cards are beautiful. Okay. Oh, we got a fox. That's good. I like foxes. Wow, another knight. Okay. Uncommon showcase. Uncommon showcase. Common showcase. Bramble Fort Fink. We got an uncommon ancillary card. We got a full art ember cleave. We got a mythic. Okay, and then we got a midnight clock, regular foil, and a bear. Down to three, guys. Come on, let's let's get something good like a foil oko, extended art or something, or something. Let's see. Roving keep, not muscle. Okay, so we got a silver flame squire. Oh, we got a turtle. That's good. Foil turtles are always good. They're never bad. Uh, Flaxen Intruder, Curious Pair, that's nice, Smitten Swordmaster. Oko's Hospitality, I'm guessing that's either Planeswalker deck or Brawl, uh, probably Planeswalker deck. Oh, we got a Full Art Emery, that's real nice, and we got a Happily Ever After, oh, that's terrible. <laughs> I guess I should be glad they give us at least one Extended Art. I call, I'll call them Full Art, but they're actually Extended, they're not Full. Like, Oko is technically Full Art. All right, let's go. This is second to last pack. Let's get some good wishful merfolk. Ooh, we got a tactician. Okay. Fell the pheasants. That's good. We got like boar token generators. That's good. Drown in the lock. Okay, we got a full drown in the lock. That's nice. All right, so we got a common showcase, which is good. Com Ooh, another secret keeper. We got a Roan, so that's the ancillary card. That's the, I think that's the Roan from the, um, from whatchamacallit, Roan from, uh, her Planeswalker deck. Eh, Charming Prince. Oh, and a foil Roan, Roan Cloak Giant. Oh, that's not too bad. It's not great, but not too bad. All right, well, yeah, we got one more pack here. Let's see what we got. Come on, something good. All right, all right, we got a ooh, lonesome unicorn in foil. That's awesome. Merfolk secret keeper. That's a common, so that's good. Another common, that's good. All right, banished into fable. Not sure where that's from. Could be brawler. Could be. No, it's got to be Brawl, right? Because it's blue-white. So, All right. All right. So, Stone Quail Serpent. Not terrible. It's not extended. That's a 0-4. So, I don't know what that is. Oh, it's a Pyromancer. All right. Wah, wah. So, let's take a look at our haul. Well, we got a... Out of our foil uncommons and commons, I think our... Drawn in the Lock is... Probably a good one. Uh, is it? Uh, yeah, the turtle is just good for flavor, but it's not valuable, I don't think, or useful. Same with the fox; it's also cool, but not necessarily going to be valuable. Uh, Beloved princess is cool, but again, so these are just cool. Yeah, like Tomer. golden egg is cool, but you know. I think so for foils, 
that are just normal um, that are common and common. Our best one was John and Locke. There you go. Whoop, and there there it goes. John and Locke. Let's put that off to the side here. Uh, for our ancillary cards, we got a bunch of stuff, including. Oh, these are. Oh, you. Yeah, I forgot we have these as well. So, oh, well, that's all right. John and Locke is still better than any of that stuff. Um, so, really, we're looking at what's our good stuff here? We got like one, two, three commons. We got three commons and uncommon. So, out of 12 packs, like four of the packs had commons and uncommons. Then we got a couple of. Um, Planeswalker rares, and we got some brawl stuff, brawl rares, uh, four, five of them actually, including uh, an Alayla. So I think the normal version of her is foil, so I think these non-foil ones might be actually worth more, which is weird to me. All right, uh, showcase versions. I didn't seem to get like a foil rare showcase version. Let's, let's look at the foils first. Now remember, in these, we're really looking for um, non-foil commons because those are not found in the booster packs. So those actually have a bit of value to them. Oh, and fairy formation. I forgot about fairy formation. Sorry about that. So in terms of, like, these you can find in regular, um, regular packs. The foils you can find in regular packs. They're just cool to have, though. So I'm always glad to get extra foils. I mean, some of them are. Like, the Fairy Guide Mother is really nice looking. The Even the Ranger foiled out. Curious Pair is great. The Silver Flame Squire, the Tactician, the Lonesome Unicorn, they're all awesome looking. All right, so we got a bunch of common ones. So that's good. You know, one, two, three, four, five. These are uncommons. We got one rare, the Love Struck Beast. So we didn't really do super well. I guess we got an Oko in the slot too. So we didn't do super well, but not bad, I guess. So I'm just separating out all the ones that are. So yeah, so we have one one rare, the Love Struck Beast, and then these are just our, our um, uncommon ones. And these, we got a group of common ones, actually, so well, not, not too bad. These are probably about, uh, at least a dollar a piece. I think the Smitten Swords Master is like a three or three bucks or something like that. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. So we made 26 of our dollars back. Just 300 more to go. So I didn't get anything crazy, right? These are our... Foil. Let's see, did we get anything good in these? Nope. So these are our foil rares. So our foil... So we got a Realm Cloak Giant, which is not exactly what I would call... I mean, he's awesome for EDH, I think. But he's not really good for value. And then these guys, which I don't think any of these are going to be super valuable. I mean... Maybe the Fey and maybe the Bone Crusher, but they got better versions. They got showcase versions, so these are not really the versions you want. Kind of glad to get a Troll King, though. I kind of like the Troll King. Oh, these are just things. All right. So on to the extended art. Uh, we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13 extended arts. Oh, we got a Secret Keeper. Okay. Um because we got that extra Oko. So Oko was probably, in my opinion, probably the best one that I pulled, I think. Uh, Once Upon a Time and Fires is, are good, probably. Ember Cleave is my one mythic. Emery. I think, I think those are my good ones. So I think Oko's like 50 bucks, so that's like 80 bucks. These, I'm guessing, are about in the 15, 20 range, so let's say they're 15, so that's another 60, so that's 140 down. Uh, these are probably like 10 a piece, so 140, 100, 
80. Oh, yeah, that's looking pretty bad. Well, I guess I didn't really... These are probably like, I don't know, two bucks a piece. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, uh, eighteen. 18. So, like, that's about two. Probably like a little bit over 200 bucks here. So, we're really looking for these guys to make up our differences. And I don't think we got there. I don't think we got to the 330. Because I think these are, I don't know, I'm guessing the castle is like 20 bucks. And the Pyromancer can't be that much. Probably like 20. So. Um, I'm guessing, uh, so where were we at? 200, 240. This guy is probably the best one that we got uh, for Extended Art, the Elder. And I don't think he's that much either, so I'm guessing he's 30, maybe? I, I haven't looked at the prices for the Extended Arts. So um, so even at 30, let's say what we're, we're at. Did I say we're at like 280 or something like that? So we, we if, if that's true, if my pricing is accurate, it looks like we've made just back barely our box in value. So for paying three hundred and thirty dollars, so we we basically we basically broke even value wise, I think. So so yeah, I mean um, I'm not so super up on the prices, and these are obviously going to fluctuate. So uh, if if I did anything wrong, if I named off wrong things, go ahead and feel free to um, correct me in the comments. But yeah, there you go. There's a entire sealed booster box or booster display of collector boosters from Throne of Eldraine. Um, having opened this up, I'm thinking I did I did order a uh, I did buy a the deluxe collector's edition um, from Wizards Direct, and I think I'm just gonna keep that sealed. Yep, that's I think that's what I'm gonna do. All right. Well, thanks for joining me. I hope all of your packs are better than mine, and. Uh, if you buy a box of collector's edition, you probably will get a much better box than me because mine seems pretty mediocre. <laughs> All right. You guys have a great day.